Hi guys. Now in this video we are doing the next case जो है oil price change. Oil price change is actually like a change in the monopoly power. Suppose हम बोलते हैं कि oil prices जो हैं वो बढ़ गए हैं. तो oil prices तो oil companies OPEC तभी बढ़ा पाएगा जब उनकी monopoly power बढ़ जाएगी. और ना वो कैसे बढ़ाएंगे? Right? क्या अगर हम बोलते हैं oil prices कम हो गए हैं? अगर उनकी monopoly power strong है तो वो क्यों कम करेंगे price? वो तभी करेंगे ना जब उनका monopoly power कम हो जाएगी. So oil price change is like a new change. So we are doing a case of new rise or new fall. You know I told you this initially only कि जो हमारे curve के अंदर AS curve के अंदर जो equation है that is P is equal to P E a function of one minus y by L comma z into one plus mu. इसमें जो ये दोनों factors हैं ना they only control the medium run. Remember? इसका मतलब हम इसका short run में impact भी नहीं देते. कैसे? We are doing that. So we are doing a case of new rising. When new rises, you know that you go to your chapter six because chapter six was medium run. जब new में या z में change आता है, तो आप अपने chapter six पे जाएंगे क्योंकि chapter six में आपने medium run करा था. So जब new rise करता है, तो monopoly power rise करती है, लेकिन one upon one plus new fall करता है. हमने chapter six में अपना WSPS curve बनाया था ना? This was one upon one plus mu, and this was W S, which gave me U N. Because of this U N, I had a A S curve, which was at a certain P E, and I had a A D curve, and यहाँ पे मेरे पास Y N आया. This U N gave me this Y N. This U N gave me this Y N, right? And it gave me this P E. Do you understand? So क्योंकि ये U N यहाँ पे है, इसलिए ये Y N यहाँ पे है. अब क्या हुआ? Because of new rising, this one upon one plus mu will fall, right? Which means that my U N increases. U N dash हो गया वो. U N increases. U N dash हो गया. तो इसका मतलब मेरा Y N जो है, वो shift होके यहाँ पे आ गया, and this became Y N dash. So suddenly जो मेरा point one था, जो equilibrium था, now one is not an equilibrium anymore. One is not an equilibrium anymore. So earlier, earlier one was an equilibrium. Now one equilibrium is not. Why not? Because you have to buy any shift. Why not? You shift. Because you have to change. Now what will happen? Now your point one is that is a normal y. That is a normal y. That is a normal y. So now, the normal y is. So now you are on 1. At 1, now suddenly you have y to be greater than yn. Because this is yn, right? This is y. Okay, y is greater than yn. If y is greater than yn, then p is greater than pe. What will happen? When p is greater than pe, people will correct their expectation. When they will correct their expectation, they will reduce pe. When they will reduce pe, they will reduce the AS curve left for shift. Two times, three times, four times, whenever it will be adjusted, we will come to this point. We will call it point two. Do you understand what happened? So, I will take another case to explain it to you one more time. Take the case of Z falling. Okay. When Z falls, that means other factors fall. Other factors fall मतलब हमारे पास union change हो गई है, हमारे पास minimum wage कम हो गए हैं, any of those things. Let's suppose minimum wage fall. तो पहले हमारे पास ये PS curve था, ये WS था. PS, WS. ठीक है? इस पे equilibrium पे मेरे पास ये UN था, और ये UN ने हमारे को AD और AS पे ये YN दे दिया. तो हम इक्विलिब्रियम पे थे पॉइंट वन पे अब क्या हुआ Z जो है वो फॉल कर गया व्हेन Z फेल व्हाट विल हैपन आर W S कर्व विल शिफ्ट लेफ्ट वर्ड यू नो ना व्हाट हैपन व्हेन Z फॉल्स हमने किया था ना बारगेनिंग पावर गोस टू द फॉर्म फॉर्म विल वांट टू रिड्यूस वेज रेट सो हम लोग W S से W S डैश पे आ गए तो हम U N से U N डैश पे आ गए which means हम yn से yn dash पे आ जाएंगे, right? 
मेरा अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट कम हुआ मतलब मेरा एम्प्लॉयमेंट बढ़ गया मतलब मेरा आउटपुट बढ़ गया राइट सो वन इज नॉट एन इक्वल एवरी मेनी मोर सो वट इज गोइंग टू हैपन नाउ वाई इज लेस देन वाई एन क्योंकि तो वाई एन एन वाई नहीं ना when y is less than y and p is less than p people will start correcting their expectations and pe will start rising as curve will start shifting right word kab tak shift karega jab tak hum as double dash triple dash jo bhi dash hai par nahi padta aap do bari mein shift dikhao panch bari mein bad dikhao 10 bari mein dikhao that doesn't matter wo kitni bari mein shift karega wo economy to economy differ karta hai kyunki har ek economy alag tarike se function karti hai but wo shift karega shift karke hamara jo eventual point of equilibrium hai that will be point number 2 All right, so that is what we do in oil prices change. I've done the next video as a summarization of, sorry, of all the three cases I've done here. All right, so I'll see you in that video, and uh, then we will come back to summarization of the chapter. All right, thank you.